Uh, distinguished President of the Republic of Turkey, distinguished presidents, uh, dear uh, guests, this is a magical organization, and I uh, would like to express my happiness in being part of this uh, Congress. I wish that this Congress will be crowned with success. Uh, uh, energy is an undeniable element of life next to air and water, not only for economic purposes, but it is also important for the daily lives of people. Uh, it is a very valuable resource, energy, in our daily lives. For some times, uh, the global conditions created serious difficulties in the energy sector. The prices and production of energy uh, have been under the impact, under the slowdown of uh, big economies and also uh, had to undergo a major transformation. The historical fall in oil prices and uh, the integration, uh, the ec economic stagnation throughout the world were uh, caused, uh, co also caused uh, the um, decrease in the demand for energy. And in the North uh, America, uh, oil and and natural gas produced there created all these problems. And also, the, uh, uh, the, uh, as a result of the encouragement of the alternative energy resources, namely energy uh, production fr uh, from solar energy and wind ener energy increased. Alternative energy um, production will increase in the coming 50 years in order to prevent a global warming. At the beginning of uh, the month of Dece December, uh, last December, a conference was organized in Paris uh, explaining that uh, the target was to decrease uh, the um, consumption of fossil uh, so fossil energy resources by 80 percent. Obviously, the solar and the wind energy has uh, increased in productions. However, their share within total energy production and consumption is rather low. Uh, the, uh, with the transformation in energy uh, in the recent uh, years, and despite all the measures taken, uh, still uh, the majority of the energy uh, production is composed of fossil uh, raw materials. Uh, risks and imbalances uh, were uh, were important uh, issues that we witnessed during this time, and that was important for every country. Every country wants uh, to increase its production, its economic productivity, and to reach uh, clean and uh, uh, durable energy resources. And this is a very natural aspiration. Distinguished guests, as we all know, since the time I uh, was elected, namely during the last 16 months, I uh, tried uh, to uh, bring the situation in Cyprus to a positive solution. And it, and in very short time, uh, we, we, it is possible for us uh, to reach a, two, uh, a federation based on two sides. The Cyprus Federation will have a major contribution in that case, uh, contributions in that case for the uh, uh, energy uh, production. Natural gas uh, will uh, be important, but also through an energy, energy corridor to be established, a very secure and uh, cheap energy transportation from Turkey via Cyprus to uh, Western Europe will be uh, accomplished.
This will not benefit uh, only us, but the welfare uh, will be shared. And this uh, will uh, give the result uh, that uh, the uh, that uh, in the region uh, where uh, Greece, Cyprus, uh, Turkey, uh, and others are situated uh, will uh, have the possibility of redefining the concepts of welfare, peace, and solidarity. Not only here in this region, but it will also expand to a greater uh, piece of uh, uh, land. Uh, next to the natural gas, also the Middle East geography will be uh, connected uh, through underground and underwater transmission channels to the Western Europe. Uh, this project is planned between Cyprus, uh, Greece, and Israel, and uh, this uh, will be a very long, uh, very strong long-term project. But obviously, there should also be an alternative that needs to be taken into consideration. Israel, Cyprus, and Turkey, a cable that would be established uh, underground between these three countries would be shorter in distance. and. Uh, the the solution of the problems in uh, Cyprus will create new horizons also in this area as well. With this feeling, the motto of the 23rd World Energy Congress, um, we can uh, say that with the contribution of Cyprus, new horizons can be opened in the energy sector for all of us, for the benefit for all of us. This would be a project uh, for everybody, a peace project for everybody. I am sincerely believing that this will be uh, materialized. And thank you very much for your attention.